I just want to say this real quick before I, I'm in the Bronx and I'm still riding home. It is October 5th. And I just want to say, man, these I mean, these people make me smile so much. I've been smiling so much today. Like Every performance I've done has been so hard today. Like, nerve-wracking. Like, you know, it's like... You know, it's so condensed and packed in, so it's hard to find a good area with good acoustics to perform. And, you know, it's like people just hanging out in the street and, and some people don't speak English and you don't know you don't know how to ask and you know um, but every single performance even the kids are like talking through it and people are walking through my scene and it feels like nobody's paying attention like at the end of each performance I do somebody's like almost all of them the first one I did not so much but the last three that I did I performed four times today like one kid came up to me and asked me like what point in the story was the scene that I did I did I think a Macbeth scene He's like, is that like at the beginning of the play? Like, where in the story was that? Like, you really want to know. And there's another. Uh, I did another scene where from Julius Caesar, and you know, and people were walking all through the scene. I didn't think the people cared, but the guy, one guy that I was watching, he like basically told me back the entire story that I just performed. Like, yeah, yeah, this guy did this, and this guy did this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. I follow it. You know what I mean? And like, um. Uh, I don't have pictures of almost any of these audiences because this is the Bronx, this is New York, and people don't like pictures taken of them. But you know what I mean? Like, and then the last thing that I just did, like, these kids were like, they had all kinds of questions about the bike and about riding. And this one kid was like, "Hey, man, you're 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 a great you're a great actor." And I was like, "Man, that's nice of you." And then the other kid goes, "Man, that's on behalf of all of us, man. Like, we all think that." And I was like, "Man, these," I just. I just, I don't know. I love my city, man. I'm, it's hard. Like I'm having a hard time. It's crazy right now here. It's dangerous <laughs> uh, to me, at least. You know, there's cars everywhere. You don't know when a door's gonna swing open and hit you. Like everything is so wild and crazy. And this dude came up. To, I was performing in some projects today, and this dude came up to me and he's like, "Hey, man, let me ask you something, man. What are you teaching these kids right now?" And I was like, "I'm not teaching them anything. I'm just doing a Shakespeare show." He's like, "Oh yeah, yeah. What's that about?" And he grilled me just like straight up you know, interrogated me, and then he's like, all right, man, I just wanted to make sure, and I was like, hey, man, you know, that's what you're supposed to do, you know, you don't know who I am, I'm showing up, and you're, he's like, yeah, man, because in this community, we don't want blah, blah, you know, anybody to harm their children, I'm like, hey, man, he's like, but, you know, no disrespect, I was like, hey, man, that's what you're supposed to do, I'm coming in here, I gather a group of kids that I perform for them, you're supposed to ask me what I'm doing, what I'm about, you know, you know, kind of vet me, and you know, make sure of who I am, like, I appreciate you, man, and he shook my hand, and <laughs> ah, I just, I just, I, I love it. It's scary. It's nerve-wracking. It's, it's, it makes me anxious. But I do, I love it. I love my city. I, I appreciate people here. Yeah, that's all. That's all I wanted to say. Uh, okay, I'm finished riding back to Brooklyn. Spear Bear out.